This is Alan with the Growing Network. And I'm Chad from Mr. Survival Hobby. And today's project is we're gonna install this solar panel. We're gonna go ahead and take our aquaponics system off the grid and uh, we'll show you how to do that. The funny part to this is this morning around 3 a.m. we lost power to the house, which meant we lost power to my aquaponics system. So my pump stopped. Uh, if I had a lot of fish in there, it would've been bad. But right now, we're gonna go ahead and get started and install these uh, solar panels. As you can see here, we have a heavy duty commercial battery. Uh, we went to our local uh, auto parts store and picked this up. Uh, our theory behind it was uh, to get the largest one that we can find. Uh, that way it can handle the capacity that we're, uh, we're looking to have. And uh, this is more than enough for our aquaponics system. And we're gonna go ahead and get it installed and we'll show you how to do it. Okay, so some of the parts that you're gonna need is an inverter and uh, this one here is just a, a basic one that you can find at any kind of hardware store. Uh, what it does is it's going to uh, invert the power from a 12 volt battery and change that to 120 volts which is what our pump will use. So uh, this one will do more than enough of what we're requiring it to do and uh, we went ahead and chose this. And uh, the prices that you can find vary. This one was about uh, 30 bucks. The idea behind this is you're going to connect this to your battery. Uh, the solar panel controller is going to connect to the battery as well. So your solar panels will go through this, charge the battery, and then at the same time this inverter is going to convert the uh, power from here and power up your you know, aquaponics system. Welcome back guys. As you can see here we've got the solar panels uh, sitting on top of uh, my shed and we have the cables going from the solar panels on the opposite side and they are going inside the shed hooked up to, to the battery and to the converter which then in turn is going outside of the shed and powering the uh, sump pump and the aerator that I've added to my uh, aquaponic system and as you can see it's thriving quite well I want to thank Chad with Mr. Survival Hobby for assisting me with this project and we'll see you guys next time with more additions to my aquaponics system.